I've seen up close, many of our seniors live isolated. No one comes to see them. They can't go out. And so that need is pretty apparent and growing. And over 30 years ago, someone saw that need and founded an agency called the Center for Volunteer Caregiving. And they have a really simple mission. They take people like me and you who can give time an hour a week, three or four hours a month. We might provide transportation to the grocery store, go pick it up or take them so they can get out of the house. We can make a big difference. It may not feel like a big thing to us, but believe me, it's huge to a person who's pretty much stranded at home unless someone comes in and gives care. I am a widow with COVID. I've been alone a lot, but Roberta has been a steady friend who will come to the house or text me or call me. And that's important for me when you live alone and you're struggling and you can't walk, to have a friend coming that lifts your spirits. The need is greater than you think it is. First of all, there are a lot of people that are home alone, that have been recently widowed, that have experienced some sort of a health crisis that has left them in a situation that they didn't expect to be in, and perhaps have family that's very far away and don't have immediate help. We need an agency like the Center for Volunteer Caregiving to kind of broker people like us and people who are isolated, they're not even in a church. Think how hard it is to go to church. Seniors aren't tech savvy who can necessarily tune in to online church. So there's lots of ways, very simple ways, that we can have a profound transformative impact on someone who's really isolated and just needs a few hours of someone's care. I hope some of you are gonna feel called to do that, helping us partner not only with this agency, but with many isolated people who need to see the love and care of Jesus. This is what we're meant for. We're meant for relationship, we're meant for community, we're meant for fellowship. It's not really difficult to find ways that I can integrate visiting Christine or doing things for her in my regular routine. So it does my heart good and it meets a need for her and fulfills both things at once. Roberta, I thank you and I really appreciate your help and your love for me. The quality time we spent together it's making a big difference in my life.